In this tutorial, I will demonstrate how to set up a config clip using RS-232 for iTool software. Firstly, take the config clip and insert the clip into the side of the unit. In this particular case, we'll be applying power through the config clip, so the instrument remains unpowered. After downloading ITIL software, select the control panel on your PC. Select the iTools applet and this will open a registry setting. Select the serial ports tab and then select the port you wish to communicate to the instrument to. Um, here I already have COM port 8 Modbus. So I've selected Modbus, COM port 8 and I've selected the tick box. Press apply and OK. And select iTools Engineering Studio. When this is opened, select the scan box and observe the enable background scan window. Your selection now depends on whether you're using the Eurotherm 3000 config clip or whether you're using an internal RS-232 module. If you're using an RS-232 module, select the scan all device addresses at the top. If you're using the config clip, select this one. Well, I'm using the config clip, so I'll select that one and select OK. This will now show the scanning box at the bottom and look for the instrument, which is now seen and brought up on the screen. After a short while, the synchronization message at the top will disappear and then you will be ready to communicate with your instrument. You can then upload or save the parameters and change the internal parameters by selecting the folders on the left hand side. 